Yo, what's up, guys? In the last video, we finished off at 1682. We're getting close to the big old Grand Champ 3, which I think is going to be actually pretty tough. We played someone in the last video who's 1685, who definitely had much more consistent mechanics. They're using a sweaty SSL car. Um, so it's going to be interesting to see see the level we're, we're getting out of players now, getting into GC3. We're about two or three wins off. We should get it this video if we win every game. Um, we definitely could lose some now. It's going to get into the pretty, pretty sweaty territory. But looking at stats, we've still only lost one game. Is that one GC one game? With all the all the server issues. But yeah, I'm expecting to lose some of the GC three range for sure. Are right, we seen SSL tournament winner title? Interesting. But I cover the net here. Take a shot. Yeah, this is gonna. This is definitely gonna get sweaty now. Good challenge for my teammate, but that also means my teammate's gonna be good. Look at him. Forgot that also means my teammate's gonna be good. Good control from him. Good patience from us. He's gonna beat me to this. You get a bump on him. Trying to just go back. A little bit awkward. It's fine. He's gonna play it back to his teammate. I like that play. Got a good bump though. Big boost steal. I'm gonna grab some pads. He missed low dribbling and he gets a good beat. Nice. Wait for this touch. Wait for this touch. The big goal. Nice. And all stems from kind of the same thing. We're getting soft controlled touches. If I maneuver in like these tight spaces, they're definitely they're definitely getting more consistent at going for bumps, like trying to close down my space, and that's what's gonna make things a little bit difficult. You've been getting like we're gonna have to see how the flip resets look and feel in terms of how much space we have. It's actually kinda open. You didn't know though. Nice, go ceiling, gets a reset. Flip. Good play. I can't really commit on this though, it's too risky. I'm gonna go for the challenge now, that way you could turn to the wall. Good touch. My team is pretty solid, I'm not gonna lie. 1695, so he's usually around GC3, that's why. But yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be tough. Like he's getting a flip reset again. Actually beats one? What the That's the most mechanical GC3. Good fake. So you get a pump on the other one. Very aggro challenge though. He's gonna get scored. No, never mind. I was gonna say he's gonna get scored on probably. He's behind him, but I'm just gonna wait. So we're seeing more bumps. I'm trying to control the soft myself. Did a good job. Can my teammate reach it? They can't either. I'm gonna just challenge, stay in front. I don't wanna throw this away. Single jump challenge. And just drive challenge. Nice. If I can get this back corner boost, it's huge. Should be fine. If he goes back wall, it's completely fine. He stayed ground though. He looks really consistent with his mechanics, honestly. Yeah, so that's what I was talking about. It was gonna probably start happening soon. Take some time and you're gonna get bumped. That's something that's definitely happened more in the last like year or two, and people are adapting a lot in lower ranks, it looks like. Just gonna wait back wall here to see what he does. It's fine. Nice good cut. Try to bump for my teammate. It's gonna be open now. He has no boost. He's playing like he has no boost. 1v1. Oh, this guy's really, really consistent actually. Makes me think he's not actually GC and it might be a little better. I don't know. Gonna wait behind you. Big shell. Really gonna throw this away. He doesn't take this boost and just wait back wall. The thing about back wall too is you see everything on the field, which I think is a super underrated thing about it. Not only is it just good to defend most things, but you have the most the most vision you could possibly have on the field. Nice. Really good play.
I am so sorry this is so troll. Oh jeez. <laughs> they're, they're getting mad at each other. Why'd they get mad at each other, man? All good. Alright, alright, alright. We've seen- okay. Wow. We've seen enough. We're good. Let's go next. Good first game there. My teammate was- wait. Oh, he was GC3. He's close to SSL. Okay, that makes so much more sense. I just realized how high his elo is. He's 1742. I just realized that right now. That's why he looks so good. He is GC3. That makes so much sense. Okay, that's what GC3 is going to look like. We're in for a treat, dude. We're in for good games, I feel like. That's like basically like low SSL. So it's going to be pretty tough. If everyone's as good as he was, it's going to be tough games for sure. That's pretty crazy the difference 50 ELO makes. That shows the rank system is actually doing its job pretty well. I feel like that was way, he's way better than DC3 though. I, guess. I think at least. I have some friends that are DC3 and they definitely weren't doing what he's doing. We'll see. Nice. He must try to bump him off. I'm trying to stay close. I'm just play it low because he went back wall. As soon as I see him going high back wall, it's my teammate forcing him high. Most bump attempts are going to lead to the opponent jumping high in some form, so you should always try to keep the ball low. It's like this mid boost. It's going to mean that this play is not going to be great. Wait for his touch. Something un uncomfortable and awkward happened there. Couldn't see him by accident, but we're on the back wall, so we can kind of deal with anything. Perfect. Good shot. Good position for my teammate, just driving up middle, saving his boost. Takes a great shot there. Let's stay on this, even though I have none. Get the kill. Interesting maneuvers. Gets saved. Well played. Looking for a little freestyle save. Gets a flip. Follows it. Oh, I'm getting hyped seeing these mechanics. Play off the wall to myself here. Should be round one. Play off the wall to myself again, maybe. He didn't jump and stuff. Play off the wall to myself again. Oh, my teammate is too close. Ah, uh, I'm okay. I was kind of trolling. I was messing with them, but. Definitely too pushed up for my teammate. He's not covering the worst case there. He's covering if I'm hard winning the challenge. Obviously I'm trolling a little bit there, but definitely still shouldn't be able. Nice to save. I'll let him follow it again. I'm trying to wait for his I'm gonna insta shell off the pop. As soon as I get the first touch, I'm taking like a super slow fall touch when I notice no one's back wall. And I just try to get nice and easy finish at the end. Obviously, it's a pretty good play, but I already had the play in mind before he made his touch. That's something that we definitely try to do as well. Like I try to think like if my team is going up the wall here, ball's probably going to come out to the right, like around here-ish. Just try to already be pre-positioning toward there. So I'm already like... I was already kind of like lined up for the play before it happened. Like you should always try to be thinking like that in advance of like, what is the most likely scenario here? I right, slip back to the wall. Good recovery. I'm gonna jump for this. Try to control this ball maybe. I might can stay closest to you. I'm gonna force this touch. So you play. What? Oh, what happened? The same situation. So, I'll, so in this situation, my, if my teammate I pushed up twice like this, and I'm staying on the ball. Uh, yeah, push up twice in the same way. So that that tells me I need to play more passive. That tells me he's not that comfortable in that position playing second hand. But he's got decent mechanics, so I should be trying to play for him in a passive sense here. So I'm gonna just let him go over and over. Again. Yep, and and I think I was mostly right. He's playing an aggressive stance most of these challenges. I'll let him go again. Look at him. Yeah, so that's what he wants me to be doing. So I'm gonna let him go. Big shot here. Let's 
can be open, but he's not gonna be there. It's fine. I don't think he expected it. I'm gonna fake chow here. Should means that he throws it away. Yeah, and you see this instant fall up every single time. He's going full speed to most balls. He's trying to be mechanical. But he doesn't want to do the, the hard work of positionally being sound. That was a good offensive challenge. Take my time here. Let's go up the wall. Try to get a flip early. Let's keep air dribbling toward the net. Really good save from them. I'm gonna take this left mid boost and just stay kind of ready for anything. I'm last man back against so this is the kind of position I was trying to put myself in. So my team was struggling to position well here. <laughs> I had a feeling just stopping and again just using the ball's bounce, use the ball's momentum to your advantage. Dodging the bump by going wide here. Then I have a free net, I have the advantage here so I can just stop. You can see how tough that is for him to deal with. Once he's passed the ball, he's not able to go back. The momentum's too hard to fight. Simple aerial toward the net because we did a nice, nice little soft cheat. And we can react to basically anything there. If we were too, if we were too quick on the cheat, we wouldn't be able to get there if we are um, what's it called? Too slow on the cheat, we also wouldn't be able to get there, so it was a good mid-range where we have some boost to work with, we have some momentum to work with, and we're gonna be able to score that most of the time. But one more game, we're GC3, and we played against Jax, who's also GC3 that game, so pretty solid stuff. Let's get into final game of the video and our GC3 promotion game. Okay, so we're playing Fluke and Wash, my teammate from last game. We have Rimsy on our team. Everyone in here is GC2, and I'm the highest elo in here, about to reach GC3. We've already played. Nice shot. We've already played. Um, let's see this. Soft touch? Pre flip? Oh my. A little flip cancel to control? That was some really good. Good control for this right. Good B, okay. Try to get a touch here. I'm gonna fake and just leave it. Cross me rotate back quicker. Teammate should be okay. Nice. Teammates teammates pretty good as well. Wave dashing. Doing a lot of pretty mechanical stuff for this rank. Feels like. I thought he was leaving that. He said no, okay. Gonna be a goal if he left it, but I don't think he knew. But yeah, he's pretty good. I mean we got a pretty good uh pretty good team in here for the rank up match. This rank isn't as toxic as I thought it would be. We had we've had some people. That were definitely toxic, but nowhere near what I thought it would be. Ah, it's a poor challenge for me. I thought his play would be more to like beat me off the back wall. He just went straight for the 50. Ended up working. Usually don't like going for that challenge. That was one that I think pretty fair to go for it. Had a pretty clean shot at winning it. Blend it in. Nice. Good stay. I'm gonna fake. Go for the bump here. It's pretty big. My teammate can go. He seems trying to stay on the ball a lot. Getting these close touches. I'm gonna let him panic there. He's gonna freak out. He's gonna freak out once more. Probably gonna go ceiling really quick with this. We saw him last game. He was trying to be mechanical the whole time. So we know his plays are really rushed. You know, his second man is uh, pretty weak as well. Go to score that. Good turns from them, to be fair. I was last back for so long, though, I feel like. What am I seeing anything? Try for the corner boost. I think you thought I, I could get out of that much easier than I could. They did a good job. They're just staying on the ball over and over again.
What, wait, what is wrong with... You know, as I was saying, the, the toxic thing... I think this, this guy might be one of those people that have, like, their Twitch or their kick in their name, and they think they're a lot better than they are, but really they're DC2, and they have a lot to improve on. I hope... I hope he watches this, I hope he has a... He sees how it can look. And you're just saying no to your teammate. Also, it's also your teammate's boost. It's also your teammate's boost to go for, by the way. On that kickoff. When someone goes for kickoff. Unless your teammate, like... Unless you land, like, right next to the mid boost. That is your teammate's boost every time. I'd say, I might actually lose this game. I don't really like what my teammates mindset is. I feel like if you're saying no like that, or your teammate's just touching the ball, like you're gonna be mentally checked out if you start losing or getting scored on. We'll see that. I just have a bad feeling about this one. He's sitting on the left mode? Okay. I'm gonna wait for him to go. Doesn't seem to want to go there. It's fine. I'm just gonna wait. Put a position away from him. Good beat from him. What? <laughs> this is an interesting one. I'm gonna let my teammate take it. He wants the ball so much, so. I think I should be trying to play more passive so we don't lose this scam, I think. Based on what he's been doing, like, what? Okay, I understand why he's this rank. I understand why he's this rank. He, he has, like, he has good mechanics, but, like, what am I... What am I watching? <laughs> why is he full speeding to the boost? I'm a man that can go for the ball. I was actually confused at first why he was this rank, but I fully understand it now. Especially if he's, like, saying that stuff to people every time. I was starting to think that maybe... Wow. I'm trying to think that maybe it was like a Murph or something of some sort, but I I, I genuinely believe it now. Yeah, we, we're gonna lose this game. He, he's given up already. <laughs> okay, that's it's funny because this is the game. I thought this game was gonna be super easy based on how he was playing at the start, but I think he has a terrible mentality. But it's a good, it's a great taste of like the true GC2. I didn't really have a true GC2 taste yet. Could still bring it back, but. Yeah, this is, I don't know if I'd play this game. If I had to play people like this all the time, I don't know if I'd play this game. <laughs> Not very fun falling for a long time. Insta chow. Incident. And he's saying no. <laughs> saying no again. It honestly makes me not want to play it. I don't even want to help him win. That's all I'm gonna say. He'll he'll figure he'll figure it out once he knows who he's actually playing with. That's actually fun. That's like that's like peak delusion. Like I'm I'm good. That's it, that's actually peak delusion out of him. I'm not gonna lie. That, that guy, that's like the, I, I I haven't seen what you guys speak of about, I have toxic teammates as that, bro, that guy was, that is up there. I played this game for 10 years. He said no at hitting the ball in like normal spots. He didn't leave the ball in spots where you could just like shoot it. Like, I, I don't know, bro. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm, what, what I'm playing with there. I'll be honest with you. I really thought he was good at the start. I really, I genuinely thought he was good the way he was moving and that. That was a big letdown. Holy, that, talk about getting tanked by your mentality though. Holy, that's crazy. All right, well, looks like we're not reaching GC3 today, unless we get like two quick forfeits here. Looks like it's not gonna happen. But... Anyway, let's get into the next game. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good one. We got a good title at least. Running into the most toxic player. And GC2. Alright, 
All right, so we lost some points last game, but we're back. And we'll try to take this one, let's see. My teammates working with me, I think we'll do great. I think we'll do great things. Big shell here. There we go, we got a nice little opening. Good save. How do you get a touch? Really good challenge. Honestly, Wash is playing pretty well with these challenges. Nice. I was trying to be there in case you wanted to like pinch with me. I was gonna flip. But... Should I get this right side? It's kind of open. Okay, I gotta get a touch that stalls. But they can't get a good shot out of it immediately. It should be that. If we miss. I'm just gonna fake. I'm gonna fake again. Really high flick. Should still have time. The teammate jumped. He got beat. Can you make it back? He does. The demo. Take my time on this. Insta chow. Seeing that's really common in this game. Surprised he didn't insta chow there. The reach guy has been doing that a lot. Or not reach. Sorry, the wash guy. Yeah, looking a lot smoother of a game. He made actually said nice shot. I think he meant it too. He's stalling for him. I'm trying the shot, honestly. The consistency's gotten so much better. It's actually insane. I basically just had my eye on the opponent the whole time there. Like that entire time, you can see on my perspective, I can see him. As soon as I see him, like creeping towards me, I'm gonna gonna go for the flick as soon as I can. Alright, we have the most toxic teammate and the nicest teammate. In the same video. That guy dude, that guy was ugh, like I feel gross after playing that game. Maybe he's having maybe he's having a bad day. Maybe he doesn't always do that. I don't know. I wanna give him the benefit of the doubt, but that's rough. Party up. Let him off nicely because I don't I feel bad. Obviously, I, I can't party with anyone for this series. It'd be not fair. It's supposed to be all solo cute, but I don't want to just not tell him anything. I'll tell him I gotta get off after this one, which I am actually. This is the last time I'm recording the night, so I wanted to reach GC3, but whatever. At least we got. Some good content, you guys gotta see me get roasted by a GC2 guy. Which now, like, I actually fully understand why he's there. Cause I feel like it's actually, it was actually super hard to win that game once he started doing that. And I feel like he like mentally checked out as well. Like stopped putting as much effort into the game. He's got decent mechanics, like better mechanics than most people have played with in this rank, but man, the mentality's up there. It's bad. Down there, I should say. For his next touch. Psycho. Don't recommend you guys do that, but it worked this time. <laughs> Trying to go for a touch to the back hole and then skim it, but. Alright. Uh, what are we? What are we? What are we? Let's see. I didn't see what you said. 1706, ah, fine, we'll do one more. We'll do one more. We'll get GC3. We'll get GC3. Hopefully. All right. So almost everyone who's GC3, except for me and Town Hero. Okay, you just missed the ball payoff, which definitely made it awkward. Hopefully you can stay on that. Oh, that is unlucky. I flipped as I thought he had the 50. That's... Ah, unfortunate, man. Shouldn't have flipped. Flipping commits me away from the play, and... 
I had a lot of trust in him there, but what did I off? I had a lot of trust in him there, but it wasn't the right play to hard trust that. Nice. This town here. Make a good play, you got it, buddy. Yeah, okay, I gotta wait. He's pretty hard committed on that. Is he gonna go? He's not back. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, it looks like we're not meant to get GC3, guys. Why is everyone trolling? Why is he trolling? He just 360 through the back corner boost. Oh my gosh, man. Just so unlucky. He's 120 ping. Ah. Uh, it's looking grim, bro. It's looking grim. This game already. What? What? <laughs> Okay, 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 what am I playing? Is he trolling? Am I just getting super unlucky? Man? What is this? How is he actually that close to SSL doing this stuff? People just don't care at a certain point? I don't know, I'm confused. All right, we'll try to bring it back, man. I don't know. I don't know. I think we're going to need a miracle, though. This is tough. This is really tough. I'm actually scared. I'm actually scared now. For what I've seen. All right, let's go crazy. Go crazy. Be confident. You you need your... Yes! Yes! Let's go. Bettine. Oh. My goat. Yes. We're doing good, we're doing good. Oh, what is that kickoff? Holy, he needs to work on those though. Didn't even flip. No, he jumped. Uh... He jumped. <laughs> He's flying through the air. Soaring through the air. Teammate is feeling himself. Confident. I gotta, I gotta. Wow, his kickoffs are just so troll. It literally feels like he's not trying to stop his kickoffs alone. Oh gosh. This game should not. What? What? Am, what is happening? Why did we queue up into the only GC2 freestyle? Oh, GC2. Oh my God, he's reverse aerial the challenge. I'm. Oh my gosh, I was never meant to win this. I was never meant to win this one, I don't think. Just God's plan. All good. Can I get a shot? Oh! Yes! Oh. Oh boy. Oh, okay. Kind of pass to him. Uh, okay, he's wave dashing into the corner. Good. Oh, yeah, let's skim that. <laughs> let's. Ah, ah, this is, this is, this is tilting. Yeah, you guys are right. <laughs> this is, I mean, there's nothing I could do to win this game. I mean, I genuinely think that. Unless I just try to, like, just solo, it won't be too carry. There's, like, nothing I can do. I don't think he wants to win. I think I think he's generally playing just for fun, which is fine, but kind of annoying when you're trying to get some elo. That's what ca what casuals for, you know, to troll. But that's all right. You want? To okay, yeah. Let's take that boost. All good. So a lot wrong with the way he's playing. Obviously, that's, I think that's I think that's understood by now. Shouldn't be full speeding into the corner, should be doing a lot of these things, taking your teammates boost, etc. But I mean, what can you do? This is definitely the last one of the video if you lose it away. It's not looking too hot, man. That in. Wow. And the the sad part is he's getting goals doing this stuff is so wrong. He's just jumping already. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. 
get me out of here. I feel like I'm trapped in GC2. I need to get out. Fleet. Ooh. Shoot that. Oh. Alright, not much in, not much learning of going on in this video. Um, okay. Yeah. He's up already, okay. Nice, keep going. I'm dead. He's gonna be alone. He needs to pull off something crazy. The town here, guys, so locked in, too. Like the complete opposite. Come on, teammate. Just shoot it. I'm bumped by my own teammate. I'm watching that. Was that on purpose? Was he actually just trying to lose? I don't even care how many points you lost. I have to watch that. That, yeah, guys, I need to get out of this. <laughs> I don't know if I'm doing road to SSL again, dude. I don't know if I can handle being in this rank, honestly. I don't think I'd play the game very long. Hold on. He's trying to bump me. He's not even going for the shot, I don't think. There's no way he mistimed it that badly. Right? He flips here. Oh, he's trying to bump me off the ball. I think. I think. It looks like it. I don't know. I don't know. Either way. Oh my gosh. We're back at 1695. We got two losses today. Uh, it's just a bad it was a bad day it was a bad day it was it's okay it's okay it's all good what can you do almost gc3 we're gonna end it there hope you guys enjoyed have yourself a wonderful day or night whatever time it is you watch this like comment subscribe and see you all in the next one i love y'all peace